everyone, Alex Matt here, and welcome back to another session of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, The World of Light. Revisited last time, we took care of sort of the entryway into the mysterious dungeon with some maze-like elements that wasn't maze-like. And we got into this dimension here, the mysterious, questionable dungeon, and we got through everything we could up to a certain point. When we last left off, we ended up here. Right where King Dedede was, because we got Meta Knight in our party finally at long last. And now, sorry to hit you on the cliffhanger there because we couldn't finish it in time last time. Let's finish up this dimension properly with our first fight. Link from the Legend of Zelda NSNES is available to us. It's a legend spirit. Oh boy. The enemy's melee weapons have increased power. The enemy's FS meter charges quickly. The Amber enemy also has increased attack power. Hmm, this is a mean Also, that he's a neutral spirit, so that means he's not very... He has no glaring weaknesses that we can put onto him. This is the original hero, after all. And to be, you know, quite um, odd, that I have not actually have not beaten... The original Legend of Zelda. I have played it, but I have never beaten it. <laughs> and if I do do that on a stream at one point, it will be heavily, hopefully put, put into my favor with, you know, like emulation and whatnot, but still. Because <laughs> I probably can't play it on its original merits. But we got our neutral spirit here. We got, what is our strongest by power? It is essentially this, a Dark Emperor right now. I need the extra stuff boosting to help me out with this. So Dark Emperor has to be it. We're gonna jam his FS charge and hopefully our smash attacks will be good. That said, let's fight. The original Link. Ready upon us. Let's do this bad boy. The original Link versus the tr the, <laughs> the, the furthest in the incarnation of the hero itself. Well, technically, I'm not sure where Breath of the Wild is placed on the timeline, but still. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, your melee attacks can't do can't do anything to me, normal Link. You are stuck in the arcades. Yes. That was actually quite of an easy fight. I was going to lie, kind of stood in my favor. But Link from the original Legend of Zelda Primary Legend Spirit 4182 power. We'll most likely put him under the power uh, onto uh, enhancement here because he might be useful. He's a neutral spirit of a legend type. That's pretty rare. All things considered and plus of his setup is pretty good. So let's set that spirit right. Let's see. Manage spirits. Level up. He has three slots, and he has sword power-up, which is necessary for some reason here. There we go. Max level, 10,459 is his max power. Not bad, not bad, but we can get some better. Oh, actually, come to think of it, I think by enhance ability, we do have a new spirit that we can enhance. Let's enhance him. This guy was leveling up um, beyond the scenes, and we got a new enhancement spirit. Cyrus, now legend spirit. 4465 power, legend mode, and has weapon attack up, so any weapon can be better with him. Let's see if we can level him up too. Booyah, yeah, 11,166 11, power, and it can only be get better from that with certain setups, so that's pretty nice. Sweet. Let's go into our next fight here. Who is this over here? It's Luigi! Luigi is finally here. Oh, someone save me from this nightmare. And I think only that brotherly love is the only one that can save it. Mario, you are up. But we need to have a way to heal him the proper way. So where is Dr. Mario? There's Dr. Mario. Let's go, Dr. Mario. Let's save your brother. Alright, so he's got blue. So he's a, we need to have a red spirit with us by power. So we can't use that. We don't have any weapons. We're going to have to go with our strongest red spirit here. There we go. And we can do physical attack up and ray gun. No, we can't do that. We need fist and dash. There. No, no, we can't. Super scope. We need fist and dash. Yeah, fist and that's the best for us. All right, let's go. 
Let's save Luigi! Luigi was the original one of the one of the extra fighters in the 64 Smash. And he played exactly like Mario, just a little bit a little different in a bit. Essentially is if you want to play as like Luigi, or if you want to play as like Melee, uh like Melee Mario, it's either Dr. Mario or Luigi that you're gonna to have to use that with. But Luigi has his own unique move set to be fair. Oh yeah! Oh, let's go, brother! Time for you! No, stop doing that! Booya! <laughs> Diagnosis! <laughs> Punch to the face! <laughs> Luigi joins the battle! Oh yeah! <laughs> Thank you for saving me, Mario! Thank you very much! Woo! Now we have him on the party, now we can go to town, probably, at most part. That's it for that pathway there. So we can now move on to our next question. Move over this little path over here. We now have a warp pipe. Which spirit is of Bowser's army? So we have here Lakitu and Spiny or Pidget. Unfortunately, it is Lakitu and Spiny are part of the Bowser's party. There are 34 spirit, not very strong, but we can still use this abilities to help us out on this. And Mario, you're gonna fight Bowser's army. Let's go! Go against Iggy. Defeat an army of fighters. Ready? Go! Oh, yeah! Let's go! Ow! Oh, yeah! Oh! Oh yeah, let's go! Diagnosis! Punch to the face! <laughs> and a leg to the face, there you go. I love how the, how the small spines are just mini Bowsers, which is actually nice to attend to the detail. I don't think I can take out spines like this! I don't know that, eh? Hey, yeah! <laughs> Put the pillows to the test! <laughs> Oh, the, the, the prime plant helped out in this. A swing and a miss. Oh, yeah! Home run! Oh, yeah! Hey yeah! Come on now! Yeah! There you go! Victory! I can do a spiny advanced spirit, 1600 power. Less weight upon the characters upon use. He's a very... Lakitu has been the most annoying enemy in the original Mario Bros. Because it was like that one enemy you couldn't hit. <laughs> because he was so high up in the air. <laughs> That's alright. That was the correct pathway. And we get another chest over there yonder. Alright. It's time to face out the other spirit. Pidget. From Super Mario series. Well, initially, this is from Doki Doki Panic. Or would be called Super Mario Bros. 2 USA. And I think it's only better that the game that technically had Luigi's initial look, hands down, will get Luigi in the play. Let's go! Play as Luigi. <laughs> I know my fights. <laughs> so it's a blue spirit, so we're going to get a... Oh, no, we're not going for weak spirits anymore. No, we have all this power behind us. We're going to use it. Let's see here. Physical attack up. There we go. They'll use that. Air attack, air attack, down special? I don't mind if I do. Pidget was a an enemy that was in the line of the army of King Wart, who wanted to take over a dreamland or the the habits of Subcon for some reason. And somehow it was all turned up with Mar in Mario's dream. So technically this character does not truly exist. Oh yeah! Oh, oh that might be thumbnail right there. That was actually kind of a cool picture by Luigi there. But Pidget is gives an air attack up, which is not bad for us actually. Again, we also have so many spirits with air attack up. It's only a matter of time where these things will basically collect dust. All right, Luigi, let's go. Yeah, let's go. I jump over here. I slide over here. I go here. I go get my treasure test. Here we are. Snacks. Again, all the treasure chests have I stated before. Any treasure chests you encounter in this area are all just snacks or bonuses. There's no real thing you can lose. 
Our next question is, which spirit created the subspace armory and raged war? Well, we got a big set of fighters to fight. First one is Ancient Minister. That is not it. Medusa is definitely not it. That's a weird picture for Medusa. It's probably the original. There's Taboo, which is technically the correct answer. We have the Prophet from Bayonetta. The Dark Matter from Kirby. And we have Master Giant from Smash Brothers 4. So we need to head to Taboo. Taboo, Super Smash Brothers series. He's taking the form of a metal Bayonetta. This guy was essentially the ultimate bad guy of the, sub of the subspace emissary mode in Brawl. And I think the only reason that he was defeated was by a little bit of a known as a Sonic the Hedgehog. Let's finish this place up like normal here. So we got a neutral spirit. We're going to get his best attack we can. Stamina battle. This is a stamina battle, so we're going to need some better stamina stats. I would rather go for all stamina if all possible. Let's see. Can we get... There is a... I do have another stamina. I know I do. Or don't I? I don't think I do. By, uh... By skill. Let's try my skill. Shooting... No, I don't have anything that. Huh. You think I would. Oh, well. We'll just keep it that way. Don't want to waste any more time. We're a little bit lower than Taboo itself, but we're going to do it. Sonic, <laughs> you're going to try to take him down since you did basically disable him <laughs> in the Sosuke's Emissary mode. Ready? Go! Oh, boy. Yeah! Oh, yeah. This is way cool. Reenacting the, the final boss. Yeah, buddy. That's not cool. I was a last second replacement <laughs> addition to the story. I don't know where I was. I was in the subspace the entire game. <laughs> oh boy. Come on, Sonic. Oh, I keep hitting you. There we go. This will work. This will finish off. Yeah! Super Sonic for the win! Taboo! Legend Spirit! PSI attack, because that's all he used, technically. 4208 power. So if you're using Ness or Lucas, this is a good spirit to use for Legend Spirits. He's also that he's a neutral spirit, so he has no glaring weaknesses, which is very, very nice. I have to anchor Sonic, but I'm going to have to go fight some other battles. <laughs> but with that, taking out the right enemy, we got the boss that shows up. And then we pulled right into the boss battle, but we're going to go immediately out of it. Because we can still get out of it for some reason. And we're going to face the other bosses, starting with Medusa. It's only fitting that we take care of Medusa with... Where is he? Where is Pit? Pit, where are the? There you are. Pit, go! Medusa was technically the final boss of... Uh, of the initial uh, Kid Icarus. Let's see, by power, we need a blue spirit to take him down. Or take her down, anyway. Between Grand Moody and do some strong throws, let's take down Medusa! Taking the form of a giant Palatina. As she was technically giant in the in the original game. Also, it's an HP battle. I just realized that. But now Pitt's, Pitt's strong with the ultimate weapons in his hand. Can take down her with no problem. Medusa is not technically a final boss anymore. But still. Also, as an advanced spirit, can be enhanced to an ace, of, to an ace if you so choose. So I feel kind of bad for the actual real uh, myth of Medusa, where she technically was technically a beautiful maiden, and then unfortunately got cursed to look like that. A hideous monster. <laughs> By Zeus, no less. Oh, it always comes down to Zeus, huh? <laughs> I told you, someone angered him in, in, in the mind of Cassiades, and look, that's what happens. You see? You don't anger, someone's angering Zeus so much. <laughs> Stop angering him. <laughs> 
All right, Luigi, it's time for you to take <laughs> battle to the ancient minister. We'll put some screen flip on. We'll keep that up there. Oh, I don't want lipstick. Let's see here. Yeah, why not? Killing Edge. Let's do that. Luigi, <laughs> you, Luigi with a bad, with a Eve with a bad stuff like that. Let's go versus the Rob team, ancient minister. Just like we said before, the ancient minister was essentially a Rob included in guys. Was also was technically under the under the instruction of of Gandorf alongside uh, alongside Taboo. And uh, in this fight here, um, Taboo or at least um, Agent Minister is being held by held by the other rope by all the Robs because the Robs are using bombs to create subspace bombs to destroy the world and such. So nice hint of detail. Also, the different colors of robs indicate the different classes of robs that you found in one in one stage, or a few stages of the floating island. Come on, yeah, yeah, <laughs> suck him up, go! Oh, yes, so part of it. Agent Minister, a spirit, twenty twenty two power, neutral spirit too. Oh, well, we're going up against more fights. <laughs> more fights, more fun, huh? Alright, let's swim out this way. Let's get our treasure chest first before we forget it. Snacks. Always nice. We'll go up against the Prophet from Bayonetta. I think, was this the final boss of the first game of second? Because I've never played Bayonetta, but I have seen it in action. But I've never seen the actual ending to the game, so... I think it's only fitting that Luigi might take this out a little bit, because we got to <laughs> clear it up. Link, come back. <laughs> come back to fight. <laughs> We're going to need the fight. We're going to need all the help we can get here. It's a blue spirit, so we're going to need a green spirit to hold out on this one. Stamina battle? Let's go. Though I do know that this prophet is technically an enemy of the witches. Has they, I think they say that they want to go after him as a fallen witch hunt. Which just gives the reason why Bayonetta goes after the prophet, technically. As far as I'm aware of, so better than, you know. I personally won't, probably won't be playing the Bayonetta series because there's a lot of risque moments in the game. And that go, usually goes against my... Uh, Sort of channel foray. But the Prophet! Advanced Spirit 1683, magic attack up. Alrighty, next set of battles is upon us. Let's see what we got here. Next up is Dark Matter from the Kirby series. Dark Matter, essentially the main antagonist. I would say this is probably one of the main antagonists of the Kirby series. At least up to a certain point. I think it was ultimately defeated in... I do believe it was ultimately defeated at the hands of... I think it was Kirby64. I would have to uh, think on that. Again, if you want to tell me in chat, YouTube or otherwise, that's always plentiful. There's a big, powerful spirit. We're going to need a blue spear for this, aren't we? There was a stronger spear here. Weapon attack up. Let's see here. Stam oh, it is a stamina battle. Beam sword equipped? Why not? Let's go! Come as sword, Kirby! Going to get to Dark Meta Knight. Dark Meta has been the antagonist of the Kirby series from, from the start. Though the fact that it was... The fact that it was that... It was essentially, Kirby essentially caused Dark, Dark Matter to show up in the first game. King Deed, he broke the uh, the Dream Wand or the Star Rod off of these off of the dreams, just so that you know Dark Matter wouldn't be formed. Kirby is like, no, the people want their dreams back. Put the dream back on, and that Dark Matter showed himself. <laughs> so, yeah, and the, also this assist trophy is annoying because it just negates all light. Well, that's not going to affect the AI at all. Oh boy, I wish I could get that darkness gone. Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, did it. oh Kirby, you're. No! I don't like this. 
There! <laughs> Darkness is defeated. <laughs> Dark matter and legend spirit. No rare goals, but it's got 40,000, 35 power to start off. Oh boy. <laughs> That was a little that was a little scary fight, if you know what I mean. Especially when you have darkness and you're not sure where the ledges are. But we only got our last few fights in this one. The last one, the Master Giant. Super Smash Brothers 4. This thing. Goodness this thing in Smash 4. Goodness this fight. These things were annoying to fight. I mean, literally annoying to fight. <laughs> Just only because is that it only showed up like in the harder variants of this of the game it's of the of the harder difficulties and it had three forms and you only had like I think only two stock to take them down with oh I have a disadvantage I need a red spirit instead of a green one huh well I've got a red spirit let's go Gino but this thing was essentially the next form of if this thing was Came out of Master Hand and Crazy Hand. This is like the core of the of the hands. You could say this would be a precursor to Galim and Darkon, if you want to call it that front. But but I'll say this now: this thing was this was a this thing was a beast, and also in harder difficulties, it had like some sort of a dungeon within itself that you had to take out cores from. This thing was a beast. It had multiple forms and everything. It was a pain in the backside to take down. <laughs> Thankfully, it's a weaker spirit in the in the world of light because it got defeated by Galim and Darkon of all that things. All right, so no, I think that's it. I think that is all the fights in this dungeon. I think it's time we take care of the boss. And what this boss could be? Well, it could be no other than question mark question mark. I'm gonna go with Link. I was I hit. I was gonna hope it was something else, but whatever. All right, it's Tina first. Oh. This is Marks. Now I do not know which game he from Kirby game he is from, but obviously I think is in case that he basically lied to Kirby about some sort of um, some sort of wish he wanted to make. Or something to be happy and everything, or like wishes and everything, and he just become like this sort of evil version. With we got these wings from this essentially his wish, but still, this thing is like the most creepiest thing from the Kirby franchise, probably. All right, you marks, I'm gonna take you down here. Oh no, 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 no! Ah, oh, I got hit by that. That hurts a lot. I'm gonna take you down, Marks. See, I use I use Link's down special or down smash because it can it can juggle, and that's what I like about it. Marks, you're going down. Booyah! Yeah, you lied. <laughs> now pay for what you have done. <laughs> Marks is only an advanced spirit, a 1588 power, and can be enhanced to ace abilities. Yeah, that's not going to be the last time we're going to be seeing him, but now he was kind a boss. He's technically pretty tough on harder difficulties, though. That's a lot of skill spheres, though. We might have to do some more stuff of that. And that's it for that. The dimension is done! The Dark Realm is another another world has been cleared. Another way for Dark to reveal himself will soon to come to pass. And now we gotta get ourselves out of here. Ugh. Again, I just I wish there was a way out of the dungeons quicker than this. <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, I'll, I'll meet you back out here. Let's uh, just do a little bit of a. Uh,